Medal of Honor, hard difficulty walkthrough for ArmageddonGaming.com. I mean, here we are. This mission is going to be mainly, uh, it's going to be a lot of sniping. Especially this mission. You get a silent sniper rifle. We're going to be using that for a predominant amount of the enemies here. Fun stuff like that, so. Short cutscene at the beginning. And, uh, yeah, we're going to go over here. We're not going to shoot these guys just yet. And, uh, they tell you that you can actually change your firing modes. So I suggest for these two guys, just, or these three guys, just do an automatic, I guess. But, um, uh, you know, this weapon's more effective to so just remain in, uh, in a uh, single shot. That's all good snipers we use. And you can also do the same thing with your rifle. Um, putting in single shot actually makes your reticule uh, smaller. Makes the gun more accurate. Which is kind of interesting, but, uh, take out those three guys, move up here, but don't move up any further, otherwise the light's going to see you, and that's bad. Pretty much just wait whenever uh, your guys say to wait. And, um, yeah. When they say move up, move up. The flashlights are the. Yeah, the, the flashlight's gonna be here again. I'm gonna wait a bit. Move up again. Yeah, fun stuff like that. Hiking up this hill. Looking all cool at night time. Okay, so here's gonna be I think like six guys. So uh definitely do full auto for this with your rifle. And uh when they tell you to take them out, just go for it. Hit as many guys as you can. Anybody you miss your teammates will probably pick up for you. That last guy will always do that fire thing, but don't worry about it. We'll talk about it. We'll head up this other hill. And uh, it starts getting a little bit more challenging uh, from here on out. Uh, these guys are going to be pretty alerted to your presence. This is a good place to use your sniper rifle. Let's bring this stuff out. Definitely make sure it's a single shot. And uh, just go for body shots on these guys. Uh, go down to these rocks right here, it's probably the best place to snipe these people from. It provides the most amount of cover, but be careful because they will kill you pretty quick. These guys get kind of nasty. Yeah. Mainly focus on these guys at the top of the hill. Yeah, grenades are not fun. You probably shouldn't run forward like I did, that's bad. You should definitely run back. I get a little bit lucky on these few guys, but it's okay. You're gonna run out of ammo pretty quick, so uh, definitely after this confrontation, or sometime soon, uh, try to get ammo from one of your uh, teammates. So that'll help out a lot. These guys are gonna be more entrenched on the rocks, and like in trees and stuff, so be pretty careful, because they're gonna be hard to see. Yeah, just take it slow, manual shots, and keep with your guys, and uh, you should be alright. I'm gonna take out my pistol because I'm pro. Spraying bullets at people. Watch this, yeah. See that? Pretty good. Yeah, definitely don't do this. I just did it for fun. Because this game is needs a is lacking in the fun category. But anyway, they're gonna tell you to run over here and uh, just tap X, and you will put the demo charge on the uh, mounted gun here. Easy enough. And don't blow it up right away, otherwise you're going to go with it. Just make sure you're over here. Do some buddy boosting. And, uh... You're going to be running for the next few minutes, actually. More of that fun stuff. Yeah. And, uh, you're going to go down this hill... Or, excuse me. You're going on this hill over here, and uh, there are going to be some trucks that you're, you need to mark. The laser, AZ-130, is going to come down and uh, take them out. And it's a lot of the same uh, controls you've done before in the previous missions. Just 
plant yourself over here. And you're gonna see the truck drive up soon. Uh, yeah. They're gonna hand you your Swifty binoculars. Yeah, you won't be able to put it in right away, so just wait seconds. There we go. And once you see the little bar come up on the bottom, just uh, hold right trigger for like a second. It'll be marked. And the AC-130 is going to take him out. And uh, you don't have to... Well, it even won't let you do multiple targets. You just put that one in and uh, that'll be it. We get to move on now after watching them explode. Getting stuck on our on our guy. Up over and just follow your buddy up another hill. I hope you can't hear my dog snoring, that'd be kind of weird. And uh, here it's going to get kind of nasty again. Some of these guys are going to be uh, entrenched pretty good in, in dark corners. So they're going to be predominantly in the middle right here, so you can just take out a few of them with some well aimed shots. This it makes your hip fire pretty, uh, quite a bit more accurate. Definitely don't use your pistol, that'd be bad. You can take them out with your sniper rifle. There are some nasty guys tagging you. But you'll probably need to get out your assault rifle again when you go through some of these buildings, because the guys will just hide in there and wait for you to come get them. Nasty grenades. As soon as uh, yeah, I throw a grenade, as I can. As soon as they're done down the middle here, run on the side and definitely watch for these guys. Put on your night vision. You need to, and definitely don't miss as many times as I did. Maybe one guy in there. A few more guys hiding. A teammate sneaks up on me for some strange reason. And, uh, yeah, there's some guys on the rocks right there. Just tag him on the inside of this building, you should be okay. Fine, dandy. And do make sure you get everybody, because you guys won't move up until uh, you've taken out every last person. Just making sure that guy's dead. I'll tell you when it's clear and you'll complete your objective. And cross this uh, small bridge, dry river, creek bed, whatever. And, uh,. Yeah, so you didn't wait for, uh... This part's kind of funny, because, like, up until this point, you've always done, like, the buddy boost thing, but, uh... Your uber special forces guys are like, you know what? No. We're gonna use this board that's right here to get up this small hill. Forget that buddy boosts. We're not that hardcore. Apparently. Anyway. Small details aside. And, uh... You're just going to get pretty close quarters, and they're going to tell you to you know, watch your corners and stuff like that. You're going to jump over here, and there's going to be one of those suspenseful scenes where you almost get killed and stuff, but you get saved just in time, so I cut that out, because it's lame. And then we're just going to continue walking. This burned out building. And, uh... I think we get to we get to kick down a door. Fun stuff. We haven't done one of those in a while. Door kicking. I'm excited. Door. Kick it in. Door kick. And there's nobody in here, and there's not even another side of the building. Kind of surprised the door just didn't fall down on its own. But uh, anyway, slap on your optics, as you can see in this this uh, cave. Down on the D-pad or down on. Uh, same thing on PS3, and uh, that guy's always going to be there, and he's going to shoot at you. Even though he's sort of crouched and looking to be undangerous. Make sure to kill him, otherwise he'll kill you. We're going to come out, and it's going to be daytime, yay! And over here you're going to have another uh, sniper sequence, where you're going to have to jump on them. Most of the, uh... Actually, I think all the fights in this mission, you have uh, the jump on the enemy. Oh uh, yeah. They're going to block you, apparently, for a little while. 
until they're ready to move up. Let's wait for all of them to go first before I can go. And they're going to tell you to go to the top of this hill right here. And uh, I don't think it's a very good spot actually. So actually what I do is I just go over here and uh, pull out my sniper, I tag a guy or two, and then I look through between these two rocks and over the top of the rocks. I feel that's the best way to uh, kill these guys without them killing you. This one guy gives me trouble. Yeah. Wouldn't take a bullet. Yeah, just manual shots on them. Uh, follow the tracer fire if you can't see them. Like right now they're through this like uh, combat mesh stuff and uh, kind of hard to see. So to shoot where their tracers are coming from. Look at the kills. There must be like 10 guys here, I think. Uh, quite a few. Uh, it's hard to count for sure because your guys take a lot of them out. Yeah. Right here, uh, once you're done taking them all out, you're going to get a checkpoint. That means it's okay to move up. This is, uh, I think, one of the first times uh, they s the enemy start carrying around G3s, just in case you're uh, into that. Also, PKM. Fun stuff if you're a gun whore like me. And, uh, those guys are going to get blown the fuck up. It's always nice. And, uh, here we're going to crouch a little bit and I guess make a game plan or something. So what's going to happen is, uh, Rabbit, you're going to be in halfback, and, uh, no, I'm just kidding. So yeah, just move up over here, and, uh, we're going to do some more laser designating with the AC-130. All these, uh, points just kind of, like, ballpark where they are, because as soon as you fire the first shot, uh, they seem to disappear. Uh, I guess maybe I could have brought it back up again if I hit up on the uh, control pad. I think that would have worked. Either way, just uh, try to focus fire on where you see the, the large plumes of fire coming out from the major guns. Uh, I don't think you can die at all. I don't even think you can fail. At least I haven't. Uh, just make sure you uh, just keep the barrage up. Uh, you have 105 shells, 40 millimeter shells, and uh, 25 millimeter shells. Uh, you can switch between them at any time. Um, sometimes, I think the 105 needs to be reloaded, but it, they all reload pretty quick. So that won't really be an issue. So yeah, I just keep cycling through them, destroying stuff, and I think there's an achievement here, but I can't remember which one. Oh yeah, anyway, we have an achievement guide for that. And uh, we're going to run over here. And uh, I guess try to flank these guys or something. And another damn cave. We're going in, be ready. This is serious business. Needs my pistol and my optics. And there's nobody in here. So that was anticlimactic. So we're gonna go walk through this really uh, oddly shaped cave. It's gonna get really dark, like I'm fading out for some strange reason. Then uh, your other two guys who split off from you a minute ago are going to um, complain like they're being shot at or something. You can see them up to the left there. So we're just going to sprint out on top of this hill. Get to watch the AC-130 shoot out flares and stuff. Anyway, just run over here, quickly run, do the dive animation thing, pick up this rocket launcher, and uh, aim at these barrels over here, shoot that shit. It's going to blow up, it's going to go slow motion because slow motion is awesome. Apparently those boxes were filled with firecrackers. And that's going to be it for this mission, so thanks for watching.